We are going to show you how to replace or repair the keyboard mechanism for gateway keyboards. What you will receive is a rubber spring cup and the key parts. Depending on your purchase, you may or may not have the keycap in your order. If you do, the clip must be removed from the back of the keycap before the parts can be installed. If you order the keycap, watch this section. If not, you may skip ahead. To remove the clip from the back of the key, you're going to want to use a small tool such as a small precision screwdriver. What you'll want to do is you'll have to get underneath the clip between the clip and the back of the key. You gently pry the clip from the back of the key as shown. You may want to try it at several different angles to get under there. We are now ready to show you how to assemble the clip to the keyboard base. Before you do this, you must make sure that the clip is oriented in its correct position. Shown here, it is currently oriented in its correct position. To determine this, you first must see if it's rotated correctly. There's a metal tab here in the center, and then there's two outer metal tabs here. This upper center metal tab needs to align with the top of this keyhole looking inner clip. There's a piece of plastic here that's going to slide underneath this clip right here. Therefore, this clip is rotated in the correct position. To make sure it is flipped in the correct position this way, you need to observe the key from the side. You can't see it from the video, but you have to look at this portion here, the keyhole part of the inner clip. There's a piece of plastic that protrudes upward. That is incorrect. The piece of plastic here is going to have to slide under this piece of metal. So for it to be in its furthest down position towards the base of the keyboard is natural. Now what we're going to do is we're going to slide the clip onto the keyboard base itself. Sliding that piece of plastic of the keyhole part underneath the piece of metal. While putting pressure on the top of the key, pulling it downward, you're going to want to push on this clip here and this clip here underneath these pieces of metal here. The clip should have a nice even scissor mechanism at this point. Now, if your rubber cup is missing from your keyboard, we have provided a replacement. At this time, you may put the rubber cup in the center of the clip. Now you take the keycap, you center the keycap, equal spacing between the rest of the keys. Push down on diagonal corners, and the key should snap into place. Now that all four corners are snapped down, check the key for functionality, and the repair is complete.